Upon popular demand, I have finally got actual BHD Army apparel out for you guys. And I'm doing a contest for y'all. Order the merch, take a picture in it, tag me on Instagram. Whoever does the funniest pose wearing my shirt or one of my hoodies, first place will win a PS4 with a game of their choice. Second and third place will get a video game of their choice. BHD out. Blasphemous HD, and today we are here to laugh at myself. So, this is a Blasphemous HD Try Not to Laugh Challenge. Hunter 1S1K, keep doing your thing, yo. Alright, so if you guys want to watch the original video, the link's in the description down below. Leg up. What's up, guys? I've been doing women with mustaches. I am so motivated to fuck movies, which are man boob boobies. Okay. This one's gonna be hard. Uh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Christmas porn. <laughs> oh, what was I doing, man? Christmas porn. Go two months ago, I was ass naked in the Orleans casino, and this prostitute who looked like Joe Dirt with panties on had like some of the biggest D I've ever seen on her back. You know, they're like flapping over the sides of her. It's really bad because that's an actual story that happened. Except it was titties. It wasn't, it wasn't, she had no penis on her back. Luckily enough for me. Do it! <laughs> Just <laughs> do it! Don't let your dreams be dreams. Yesterday, you said tomorrow. So just do it! Make your dream! And today, <laughs> we're gonna watch a video called Donald Trump almost taken out by a car crash on live TV, man. <laughs> and this is, gonna sound, this is gonna sound super real to some people, and it's gonna sound like weird as fuck to other people. But dude, right now I live in real bad neighborhoods. It's boring as fuck. Dude, when I was a kid, man, I used to live in the suburbs, man. I don't worry about getting shot at. Fuck. Those areas never were boring, yo. And dude, I sold drugs. I ain't even gonna try to lie to y'all. Like, I sold drugs, right? Look, I'm not going into that shit, okay? What happened was... Look, I never sold... Okay. I'm lying. Only one bag of weed. One really big bag of weed when I was younger. But I learned that that wasn't what I wanted to do because there wasn't no real positivity in it. There wasn't no real, you know, come up in it. Like, yeah, you make good money, but you got to deal with like some of the worst people and you got to deal with some of the worst situations and you don't get no peace of mind. Super duper not worth it. Don't do it, kids. I've sold crack. I'll just say that. So fuck no, crack. I now, I've seen no. these arguments happen between Donald Trump and crackhead. They will fight you because you're not willing to give them the ass that you told them you give them for some titties or something that they would do before they do the titties. Like they want ass, but they'll never come. I swear to God, yo, it's so just it's just so hilarious that these people expect you to believe like, oh yeah, yes, I break into someone's house and steal their virginity. But I'm also gonna come and, you know, if you just give me all the ass up front, I'll come later. Like, come on. I mean, Sam Pepper is a crazy bitch. He would lick my penis. When I was a kid, I'm like, mouth sex? That's it? It resulted in him getting shitted on on the internet, which I personally don't understand because I don't understand people who don't want a blowjob from Sam Pepper. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that sounded bad. This Oh, Lord. Let's, uh, well, at least the ending was true. <laughs> this bitch. Try not to cringe or scared or something. I don't. What type of child molestation festival is this? <laughs> Oh, man. Gyrating the 
their pelvises at, 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 at kids and shit? What the nigga in the back has got that single bell and whistle tooting it on his pelvis and shit? I'm like, what the f I hate to say it, man, but Drake looks like a complete rapist. I don't know why. It's something about that dancing. <laughs> uh-uh. Nah, I wonder who I was really talking about, though. <laughs> I see why a lot of you guys want my older videos now. That's one of the things that makes Hunter so good at what he does, is he understands the value of the beat drop. That's real. Yo, okay, no, I, I swear to God, I was about to say this nigga looks like a brony. Good thing you guys can't see the fact that I'm in my boxers right now. Some of these intros be so f***ing obnoxious, dude. Dick is always usually out. What it is, guys, it's Boy Blast from HD, and we're back to two kids, Jared from Subway. Skills are on fleek. Uh, the link for them shits will be in the description down below. Uh, Twisms. Wait, shit. Oh! oh! That was some acrobatical shit. Dude, somebody should have added in the yeet sound effect. Yeet! Perfect. Yeet! yeet! <laughs> I was right! That makes it millions times funnier! God, Jesus! <laughs> Just hit the bit. What did she do? Like, the only time I could see something like that being uh, warranted is if, like, I smash this chick and then afterwards she comes and tells me that she's actually a f***ing kid. Now I've got to beat the b I believe what I really said was that she was a man. And that still stands. If I smash a chick and later on she tells me I'm a guy, well, there's nothing that says beating on men is wrong, so I expect a fade immediately. Bitch up. Technically, it's not even the bitch. It's a kid. So now I can doubly whoop that ass. <laughs> this guy yeeted in the face. <laughs> what did she do, though? Bitch, I said fucking old English and just hit this. Kick the bitch. But yeah, man, Twisms. Okay, so I've never seen this one before, but it's from Awesome Guy X3, and we're gonna check it hey, out. Hey, buddy. It's your boy, Black, and today we're here to f black people. See, okay, y'all don't see, y'all see the boobs on Hermione Granger? No, I only want to see her pictures for uh, investigative purposes. Yep, for you guys, <laughs> and, and nothing else. So yeah, man. <laughs> Okay, I've got to check that shit out. Uh, Chris Brown beat you because you're not pretty enough. What the f***? <laughs> this is well done. I love this. We're here to Jesus. That's no. not. Black people. Let's try. I tried to have sex with a bottle cap. Hermione Granger. I didn't try. As a young person, I would say I succeeded. There has boobs, man. I did not see that shit coming. She's just gotten badder and badder. <laughs> Give it up, motherfuckers! They'd be like, oh my god, no, look, we don't have a lot of money. Please, here, here's what's in our register. Get money shit out of here. Go back there and bring us all the fing uncooked hamburger meat that you can carry. Right now! <laughs> Hey, yeah, everybody, my life hasn't been going good, and I don't know what I'm going to do, and I just don't, no one really likes me, so I've decided that if in a year I don't have a lot more friends, then I'm not being invited out to a lot more public events, and, you know, and my life isn't better, and I haven't found a, 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 a girlfriend, then I'm going to kill myself. Bruh, I remember that story, bro. 
there was this guy, I think his name was like Sharif or something. Uh, that's not how you pronounce his name, but I'm gonna mispronounce it on purpose because I don't want to out him. But then he made a Facebook post like that, telling people that he was gonna kill himself if he didn't have more friends and wasn't invited out more in a year. And then people in the comment section down below, of course you write a text like that, everybody who's on your friends list is now obligated to, you know, act like they care. And I just thought that was hella douchey. And I was like, man, yo, shut yo, cry baby ass the hell up, man. Like, bruh, if you, if you need to go get mental help, then go get mental help. But stop trying to obligate your friends, family, and the people on your Facebook lists to start kissing your ass. My God, Becky, come here. We found him, best guy ever for us. See you, that's how you know that he's a great guy because he's willing to kill himself and more than likely me if our relationship doesn't work out good. Because it's not robbing somebody unless you take a selfie and picture of the crime weapon while holding your identification card to prove that you actually did the shit to the police. We need to get rid of the people who might breed and those offspring are going to like Set the whole world on fire. If I'm doing crime with somebody, man, you know, and I get pinched, I'm telling. Every single time, nine times out of seven times, I'm snitching. <laughs> what did you think was gonna happen? Damn, these motherfuckers got more shit in their prison cell than I got outside of prison. Shit, all this time I've been trying to stay out of jail, maybe I do need to commit some crimes, man. Fuck. They got more stuff than I do, ain't this a bit? Candy, or that's how you lure someone into like the back uh, ice cream truck nowadays, is by offering free Wi-Fi. <laughs> Candy don't, doesn't work anymore, not that I would know. Dude, I still don't even understand the science behind dick pics. It still baffles me. I've never seen a chick look at a penis no matter who it belonged to and was like, oh my God, you know what? I'm gonna put that in my mouth. Oh. Your first thought when coming upon someone's dead body is, you know what? Let me take a selfie. Do, 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 do. I'm just glad that he wasn't black. We've taken too many L's this year already, man. Tiger accounting for like 80% of them. You know, try to f uh, it was like dangling the heart in front of the little chick and shit. You're just thinking something else, like we, we don't need any more blemishes on our already sullied record for 2000. This nigga is dressed like the Hamburglar. Alrighty then, well, I believe I've laughed at myself enough for the day. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, Make sure to comment, like, and or subscribe. It's your boy Blast from the D, letting you know the twisms. And have a nice day. Regardless of what craziness is going on in your life.